This fake handhold effect is perfect for spicing your reels up a little bit, making them look a little different and stand out instead of just this the boring old tripod stand. So I'll show you guys how to do it in After Effects for absolutely free. I'll show you three different ways. Two ways are we're gonna be using a plugin called Shake Sauce 2. It's totally free, seven days free trial. And if you refer three of your friends, then you will get it lifetime for free. So definitely go check that out. And let's get right into this. So the first one is the, the easiest, the quickest way to do this. All you have to do is go down over to the Shake Sauce. You can see in the top right corner. Go to your presets tab right here. Hit constant. Make sure there's motion blur on and mirror. Then we'll just hit handheld shake. Click on your clip. Hit this check mark. It's going to automatically place it and watch. You can see it has a nice little subtle movement effect that just gives it more of like an outdoor view by me looking at these plants. If you want to optimize it yourself, just go up to your effects control, hit the position, and you can increase the amplitude and frequency to make it go faster. So I wouldn't recommend doing it too much because then it just looks really bad and it's way too fast for doing anything in general. This is what it looks like at 12 and seven and a half. And then boom, you get a more of aggressive kind of look. It doesn't really look the greatest, but hey, if you're trying to do some kind of earthquake type stuff. <laughs> Second way is also by using the Shake Sauce preset presets. Let's just delete this by clicking on it in this little trash can. And you can click any of these, but the, the other one that I would recommend is Smooth Hands. That's just gonna give it a nice, not like a shaky, kind of more of like a smooth wave type of effect. And as the same, you just click it, hit the little check mark. It's gonna add it. And now watch. Yeah, I like that a little better. It kind of moves with the plants instead of just sitting there, which looks really nice. The final part is making one yourself by using keyframes which is time spending and just there's no really reason when you got a free plugin over here but if you guys don't really want to do the hassle and do all that I'll still show you how to do this let's first for this final way hit s on your keyboard so you can scale in a little bit so then when the handshake movement works you're not having these black kind of edges that just look bad and no one really wants to see so zoom in a little bit, I just went to 106, then hit position and put a keyframe every five frames, and we're gonna make four of them. So just like I've done. And for the first one, I'm just gonna move it to the left and up top left slightly. And go to the second one and move it to the right and bottom right slightly. Third one, I'm gonna move it to the left and bottom left. And then for the last one, I'm gonna move it right and up to the top right. Then make sure to highlight all of them. Right click, go down to key frame assistant, easy ease, or just hit F9. Lastly, just highlight all of them, go five frames, copy, paste, do it again and again and again. It's kind of really rough, but just expand them out. So probably every maybe 20 frames, I'd say. Do it about every 20 to 25 frames and you're perfectly good to go.